Hi, I'm Dr. Amir Hamza, Abdul Latif, Consultant Clinical Immunologist, Allergist and Pediatrician. Welcome again to another episode of uh, Diseases of the Skin. And this time, let's go and talk about scalp health. We forget that the skin is actually covering our head. So, what are the two things that we can talk about uh, when we talk about scalp health? The scalp, obviously, there are two main problems that uh, we encounter every day, and that's going to be your good old dandruff problem. Yes, but it's not good. All right, it's abnormal, it's stressful. Again, a lot of things that I deal with probably is a lot of stress to everybody, but never give up hope, right? Be always positive because that's half your battle already done. Okay, being positive in your outlook in managing diseases. And the other problem is even more probably depressing, hair loss, right? But again, sometimes that might not be, be uh, something that we can overcome um, because sometimes I've been told, if you look at your dad and your dad is not losing any hair, you're not going to lose any hair as well. So whatever that means, you can figure that one out. But we want to look into the general essence of scalp health. Because um, when we talk about uh, scalp health and we relate that to what I've mentioned about eczema, and in a way, the skin generally would get rid of uh, all the dead skin, right? We all flick, we all shed a little bit, but it's so slow and it's so little at the time that we don't realize it, okay? From the time that we have a brand new skin cell and until the point it becomes dead and it flakes off naturally, it probably be about four weeks. Whereas in conditions that can produce dandruff, then it might just happen in two to seven days. So it is enhanced. So obviously, all the dead skin are just being flaked off faster than usual. So obviously, there are going to be lots of causes for the dandruff. But and um, one of those things is uh, it's not related to poor hygiene. So that's one of those things. People think that ah, you never wash your hair. Yes, probably you never wash your hair. That's why you get your dandruff. So um, again, I'm always looking out for things that are natural, that are complete in trying to address all the issues that we have been talking about, and in this case, the dandruff and the hair loss. So with uh, this range of uh, Dr. Bart. So we will have to think about things that can naturally address the problems that I've just mentioned and that would be the dandruff and the hair loss. And as usual, these are organic products, plant extracts that has got the EcoCert certification and that's always wonderful news and you can be rest assured that they are not going to contain things that are going to be uh, in a way even allergenic right and no steroids okay it's not to do with medication these are wonderful natural products that you can use with confidence so what's wonderful about these uh, products for your scalp health is that uh, it, it has been done up in three steps okay three simple steps it won't go wrong okay you want to cleanse you want to condition and you want to nurture they are different formulation for each of the different conditions and of course that makes sense and that also reinforces that the care that has been taken to look into the formulations because to address the dandruff problems certain formulations and the hair loss another set but three easy steps that everybody needs to address so what I'm going to just mention next is just to put it into perspective and discuss both things separately a little bit because I don't want uh, all of you to get a little bit uh, uh, jumbled up and think that we can use this interchangeably. Right? These are two different conditions and they are two different products. So we have dandruff as the problem whereby you know we talk about the scalp being oily and hence attracting a lot of each and a lot of microbes there so we have the formulation here in the doctor buds that would address those problems so bring it down so that it won't be so oily and then there will be antimicrobial activities 
of the ingredients. Now, whereas the hair loss is all about the scalp health in general, because it's not healthy. It's not healthy in its structure. It could be all clogged up, and we want to unclog all those things so that it becomes uh, healthy again. And hence, that would prevent excessive hair loss, further excessive hair loss. We cannot say that it's going to regrow. I don't want to say that. It would naturally uh, bring back your state of health to the scalp so that the hair that are there now is not going to excessively fall off. So I think that's the main thing that we need to appreciate with the formulation here. But no doubt, I'm sure it is a very good uh, extracts, plant extracts here that they have here and it will do the job. So when we use these products for your scalp health, okay, so as I already mentioned from before, we have the three steps. Okay, so we would want to cleanse first, right, the scalp and this cleanser is a very mild, soothing uh, cleanser. So the one thing that's wonderful about this Thing, these two products where you cleanse and condition is you can use it with confidence onto the scalp as opposed to the more conventional uh, you know the shampoo and conditioners where they just say don't put it onto the scalp but just on the hair so what's the point of just addressing the hair when the problem is in the scalp okay so it's the scalp that needs to be taken care of and hence having the right uh, gentle and at the same time very uh, uh, effective extracts then we can use it confidently and really massage it in and I'm sure once you massage yourself in that it really gives yourself a nice good feeling as well so use the, uh, the cleanser first and then of course you have the conditioners for both of them this is of course whilst you are still in the bath right the, the shampoo and your conditioner and this is after when you dry and then you use your serum huh? whether it is for the dandruff or the hair loss okay so the conditioner sort of uh, reinvigorates your hair and revitalize and gives vitality so whereas um, but of course it gives the overall uh, effect onto the scalp as well for the both of them and then after that once you have done that you dry up your hair now after uh, you have done the shampoo and conditioning then you will put the serum and this will now uh, bring in all the nutrients that will be absorbed into the scalp and until your next wash so isn't that nice and beautiful nice and simple three easy steps you can't go wrong uh, it's just like saying ABC one two three